Hello everyone, hope you're all doing really well. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hope you've had a really nice day. It's been beautiful here. It's still cold, but the weather's been glorious. Blue skies, sunshine, really, really, really nice. And it makes you feel so much better when you see the sunshine, doesn't it? Anyway, I thought I'd share with you my weekly food shop. I've been to Tesco's and I also went to Lidl's where I only got a few bits from there. Didn't really get much because I got most of what I needed from Tesco's. Uh, so let's dive straight into it and I'll show you what I got. I'm on a bit of a health kick. Not going to lie. Look back at the video, last video that I did, the Shane Curb haul, and oh my God, I just realised you are a fat shit and you need to lose some weight love so i'm on a health kick i've bought loads of fruit and vegetables and healthy stuff and i've also started doing some exercises and oh my god i started yesterday and i can hardly walk today my legs are bloody killing me but i'm going to keep doing it i've got to lose some weight i've put so much weight on during this lockdown it's unbelievable i've never been this big in my life apart from when i was pregnant so I just want to feel a little bit better in myself, ready for the summer and lose a few pounds. I don't want to be super skinny or anything like that. I'd like to just fit nice and comfortable into a size 14, I think. You know, just lose a bit of the, the belly flab. I'm absolutely disgusted in myself. But you know what? Moving forward, I am definitely on a health kick and I've got to lose some weight for the summer. So that's enough of me rambling on. I will show you what I got. I'll just do it bag by bag because I just chucked it in and I'll show you what I got. There's quite a bit. So grab yourselves a drink, get comfy and I'll show you what I got. There's only a couple of things in this bag. But I'll show you what I got from Lidl first because I only got a few bits like I said. So first thing I got was um, a multi-grain farmhouse loaf. Um, that was 79 pence. Uh, I do like brown bread, so I'm switching from white to brown. I've done it before, and it really, really does help just making the small changes. So, brown, brown bread for me from now on, and this is the multi-grain one, and I, I do like that. So, And then I picked up some sweet chilli hummus for carrot sticks and cucumber sticks and stuff like that, which I absolutely love. So there's only two things in that bag, so we'll chuck that one out in there. Um, Lidl's, Lidl's, this one. And then I picked up some sweet potatoes. So I do love potatoes and bread. It's my absolute downfall. I do like sweet potatoes, so I'm swapping up. I'm only going to have um, white potatoes normally um, once a week on a Sunday on my Sunday dinner, so that's, that's what I'm going to do. Normally we have um, potatoes like every other day and it's just too much carbs. So I'm swapping out for the sweet potatoes, um, uh, wedgies and fries out of them. I don't like sweet potato jackets. They're just too mushy for me. I don't like the texture, so I'm just going to do wedgies and fries with those. And I also got some um little vine tomatoes they was one pound 25 the sweet potatoes i think they were 69 pence and I picked up some pears les loves fruit i like fruit but i normally tend just to grab for crisps and stuff like that so that's that's another change i'm gonna make so bought quite a bit of fruit um some conference pears they were 69 pence then I picked up some uh, wild rocket because I do like that in a salad. I love the taste of rocket. That was 45 pence. And I picked up some more tomatoes, but the cherry ones. I've bought quite a few different tomatoes because I'm going to, as everybody's seen that um, pasta thing that everybody's raving about on TikTok with the, the feta cheese. So I'm, I'm going to be doing that for our dinner tonight. It's a block of feta cheese and you bake it with the tomatoes and garlic and and stuff for 35 minutes it goes into a sauce then you add it to your pasta so i'm going to try that tonight so yeah cherry tomatoes 45 pence uh some basil for that recipe you need to put basil in it so i've got some fresh basil that was 45 pence the feta cheese i picked up 
How much was that? 60. I don't know, 65 or 85 pence for the, the feta cheese. So I got that. I mean, oh, that's not really healthy. It's all red on the bottom. But, you know, I can't be 100% angel all the time, can I? So I'm still going to try it. The pineapple. Uh, that was 69 pence. Some grapes, white seedless grapes, they were £1.25. And then I picked up some of these. I've been wanting to try these for ages, these sweet peppers. I'm going to slice them open and I think put um, cheese in and, and, and stuff and bake them in the oven. I'm going to find a recipe for those anyway. Um, but I love peppers, so I'm going to try those. They were 99 pence. And then the last thing in this bag was some oranges, medium-sized oranges. They were 99 pence as well. That's that bag out the way. Right, uh, moving on to Tesco's. Uh, there's three bags from there. So first thing, I picked up some bottles of water. These were, how many? 12 for £2. Because our tap water here, oh, it's royal. It's got like um, a metal taste about it, so I don't drink tap out, uh, water out the tap. So, bottled water every time, £2 for 12 And then, let's get another bag. Let's see what we've got in here. We're running out of space. Picked up these pop chips. I absolutely love these. And they are only 97 calories. So popped, not fried. So we've got the barbecue flavour and the sea salt flavour and they were a pound with the club card. I saved quite a bit in Tesco today. I think I saved about £13. I was, I was rather impressed. Picked up a few uh, reduced bits. These are Welsh beef quarter pounders. Love burgers. Can't cut everything out. I've, I've still got to have some nice stuff. So uh, these should have been £3 and they were reduced to £1.35. So I've got two packs of those. I'm just going to bung them in the freezer. Use them as we need them. And then I picked up this. This is tandoori chicken pieces. Um, that should have been £2 and it was reduced to 84 pence. So I thought that would be really nice um, with a bit of salad in a wrap. I got something else to eat. Bag of mixed peppers, they were 99 pence. The cucumber was 49 pence. Some bean sprouts, bean stir fry, they were 69 pence. Some more tomatoes, just salad tomatoes, they were 49 pence. And I got the um Stir fry meal deal again. I always pick it up when I go in because I just love a stir fry. So it's uh, three things for I think it's two pound fifty. So I've just got the vegetable stir fry, the egg noodles, and the Chinese inspired sauce. Absolutely love a stir fry at the moment. Uh, picked up some bananas. They were sixty nine pence, I think. Yeah, sixty nine. An iceberg lettuce, 45 pence. Can you see where we're going here? Loads of fruit and veg. Oh my God. I'm going to be a skinny mini by the uh, time the summer comes. Not. Some radishes. I don't like radishes, but Les loves them in a the salad. So I always pick him some up. They were um, 39 pence, I think. Yeah, 39 or 49. And some plums. They were 69 pence for six plums. That's another bag done. Let's just move it over here. Next bag. Picked up some baby wipes. Um, sometimes, you know, I just can't be asked to, to do the skincare routine. I know that's really um, lazy of me, but I'll use a baby wipe to get the majority of it off and then I'll go in with a cleanser and stuff because sometimes I just, I just can't be asked. So, uh, a pack of Pampers Sensitive Baby Wipes, they were 79 pence. And then picked up a what, uh, yellow melon. 
not a galia melon honeydew honeydew melon um so i'm gonna like the the fruit and stuff i've bought some little tubs from tesco's i'll show you those in a minute i'm just going to cut it all up put it in the little tubs and stick it in the fridge and then you know just pick at that instead of going for um crisps and chocolate and crackers and stuff like that so that was um 89 pence i still picked up a few nices for les because you know he hasn't got to uh, go on a diet just because I am. Got him um, the dark milk giant buttons. He loves this dark milk. So I've got him a pack of them. They were the pounds. Some more tomatoes. Some baby plum tomatoes. They were 89 pence. That's again for the, this um, TikTok recipe thing. And then I picked up a bag of carrots. They were 49 pence. For that big bag you get a kilogram for 49 pence which i thought was really good um for carrot sticks and to put in a salad uh, grated on a salad i kind of like that uh, some grapes they were one pound nine pence for um red seedless grapes and i picked up some blueberries again just to put in the fruit pots to munch on some strawberries these were reduced from two pound to one pound 42 just a, um, a box of strawberries there absolutely love strawberries they're my favorite fruit ever and some more uh, easy peeler oranges they were one pound 29 and i picked up some of these these romaine heart lettuces so i thought they'd be nice chopped up in a salad as well and they were 89 pence i think they were or 69 pence can't remember and i, I don't know where my receipt is sorry uh but yeah and i thought i'd give them a go i have had them before and i think they're quite sweet so they'll be nice chopped up in a salad and then these are the pots that i got to put the fruit and stuff in whoops so you get three that size they're not massive but i thought they was big enough just you know to portion things out so they were £1.50 for those three and then I got three smaller ones for the fruit and they were a pound for three so I thought that was quite good value you know just to stick in the freezer You're just plain white plastic with the lids on so I can you know do a bit of preparation with the, the fruit and salad and stuff and just pick at it put the carrot sticks in there and stuff like that so that's another bag down we're on to the last bag now guys and I'm running out of space. Picked up Les and Aunt Bessie's apple crumble. That was uh, one pound, one pound twenty-five. I think that was. Um, he, he loves apple crumble and custard, so I picked that up for him. And then picked up some more of these hot and spicy chicken um steaks absolutely beautiful these are the one pound 65 for four and they are so tasty they are hot and spicy and they, i love them in a wrap and les loves them as well so we have them in um, wraps with salad so yeah really really like them and then i picked up i was watching youtube last night and i was watching rosie tilly i don't know whether you watch her she's lovely and i love watching her channel and she'd done a vlog and at the end of the vlog she was having a cup of tea and she showed what tea it was she was drinking and it was this twinings sleep and when i got to tesco's today they were on offer for one pound 29 and i thought you know what i'm gonna try these i don't really struggle with sleeping but les does so whether I'll get him to try them, I have no idea. But there was a lady buying some when I was in there and she says they really do help you relax and get to sleep. They don't knock you out, but they help you relax. So for £1.29, I thought I'd give them a go. And there's 20 tea bags in there. Um, we'll see. It's spiced apple, vanilla, vanilla, chamomile and passion flowers. So... I don't know whether Les will have it, but I'm certainly going to give it a go. See if I can get into it. I sleep okay, but I'm just out of a routine. I stay up late, get up late, and it's just not good. It's not healthy. So I'm going to try um, to get into a better sleep routine as well. 
So I got that one and then because they were on offer, I thought I'll pick a couple up. And there was this one. This one's called Glow by Twinings. And this is strawberry cucumber with green tea and aloe vera. Again, they were £1.29. Uh, so, all good ingredients. And I do like green tea and it does help you lose weight. So, that's another one that I got. And I also picked up this one. This is called Detox. This one's lemon and ginger with burdock root and fennel. That one's I said that nice. But you know what? If it's going to help detox, I'm just going to have to force it down and, and just do it. But it does say great taste. So, and there's 20 in there again. So I'm going to give those a go because I do like tea. Les is, I do like coffee. But Les is more of a coffee drinker than a tea drinker. So we'll see whether we can get him into... Uh, the sleep ones and then I bought Les some hot cross buns they uh, were a pound and then I picked up for the burgers for me because I just you know I, I do love burgers but I thought instead of having the white um, buns I'll get the whole meal for me so I got four whole meal ones they were 70 pence and I also got the white ones for Les they were 70 pence as well for four. Nearly at the end there, guys. And I picked up a couple of yogurts to go. I'm, I'll, I'll just eat this out of the pot, but I thought it would be nice um, with the, the fruit as well, you know, for breakfast. So I picked up a vanilla one. Skia, is that how you say it? These were a pound. And it says high in protein, reduced sugar and fat free. So I picked up a vanilla one. And I also picked up a strawberry one. So for over the fruit. And then I picked up myself some Flora Light because um, normally we just have stalk or best butter. So that's another change I'm going to make, the lighter one. Uh, Fairy Washing Up Liquid, £2 for that big one. I always have that size. It lasts for ages. And then the last thing I got, guys, was a white loaf for Les, uh, you know, Warburton's. It's got to be Warburton's every single time. And that's everything that I've got. So I didn't do too bad, really. Um, I spent £43 in Tesco and I spent £11 in Lidl. So, what was that? 43 53 54 54 quid. And I got absolutely loads. So... That's uh, me not having to go out now for the rest of the week because, you know, we even though our travel restrictions have been lifted a little bit, the stay at home order has been lifted, um, but it, we still got to stay local and hairdressers are open and that's it. Still can't buy non-essential stuff here. It's only essential stuff. All the oils are still taped off and everything. So, you know, I don't know how long it's going to be well, till they um, lift that restriction, but we'll see. Anyway thanks for watching guys um this uh tesco and lidl food haul i hope you've enjoyed it just sharing you know my uh new healthy regime i'll keep you updated on how i'm doing i do need to invest in some weighing scales because i haven't got any so i'm going to order me some offline tonight so i can keep track of my weight loss hopefully and i'll keep you updated of my journey so I'm off now to go and do my exercises and pass out on the floor again like I did yesterday. <laughs> Never mind. It is what it is. You know, it's got to be done. My legs are killing me, but I've still got to go and do the exercises because I've told myself I'm going to do it every single day. So, again, thank you. Thanks for watching. Thanks for passing by. And I hope to see you all again soon. Um, you can follow me over on Instagram. I will leave the link below to my uh, Instagram page. And I hope to see you all soon with my next haul, which is a small business haul. So, again, guys, thank you. Thanks to all my lovely subscribers. And I'll see you all very, very soon. Love you guys loads. Enjoy the rest of your week. Bye.